Hello everyone, you're watching Palisades Today. I'm Juliette Lamar and in the news this week, Palisades Business Improvement District pays for new trash cans and benches and a brush fire burns over a quarter acre. So stay tuned. But first, a little about our sponsor, Santa Monica College, with more than 90 fields of study, is a leader among California's community colleges in transferring students. There's a seat for you at Santa Monica College, so find your classes today. Our top story, Los Angeles frontline workers will be receiving hero pay in the coming months. We have all the details in this video up next and we'll be right back with your local news after this. I think they deserve more on the front lines, the amount of traffic that they see, interactions with people every day. I feel like they should completely get um, five bucks extra. So hard times out here and they need a, they need a little extra boost. And now for what's happening in your neighborhood, the Pacific Palisades Business Improvement District, AKA BID, whose boundaries stretch along the Palisades Business District from Via de la Paz to Cary Street along Sunset and then north and south of Caruso's Palisades Village has made some city improvements. BID placed new trash can receptacles and benches throughout the, the business district in December. With a yearly budget of $150,000, allocating funds for these projects can be a little tricky. In addition to the new benches and trash can, the bid must also find a way to pay for street cleaning, sidewalk cleaning and clearing, and tree trimming, which can cost upwards of $30,000 for tree trimming. Saturday morning, a brush fire broke out near the 300 block of North Bellino Drive. The small blaze started as a result of the ignition of a compost pile that was made up of green brush. Surprisingly, LA Fire Department was able to extinguish the flames within 10 minutes, good job guys, and they burned around a quarter of an acre. No people, animals, or structures were harmed. Right now, exactly how the compost fire started is under investigation. Well, that's all the news that we have for you today. Thank you all so much for tuning in. I'm Juliette Lamar, and you take care.